Investigators are trying to figure out what caused a hotel fire this morning that forced the evacuation of about 100 guests. It happened at the Extended Stay America and Warren near the Civic Center. We're told the alarms went off early in the morning after a fire on the second floor. No injuries were reported and the people that were evacuated from their homes have been moved to another extended stay hotel in Sterling Heights. The U.S. Postal Service has now agreed to attend tonight's town hall meeting discussing mail issues in Ypsilanti after backing out last night. Yeah, the meeting was planned by Congresswoman Debbie Dingell after residents continued to complain about dozens of issues concerning mail delivery. The Congresswoman will now not be in attendance due to a USPS concern about violating the Hatch Act. Uh, Dingell told uh, the Postal Service if they didn't attend, she would document every case of poor service and deliver them directly to the Postmaster General. Now across Michigan tonight, Michigan State University's interim president is donating his salary back to the university. John Engler was tapped to lead the university amid the fallout over the Larry Nassar scandal. Under his new contract, he'll receive an annual salary of $510,000, a salary he has now voluntarily agreed to donate to MSU-related charities. He's not yet announced which areas of the university uh, will be receiving his compensation.